Web and FC TV with Adam Hinchwood. Adam, uh, your thoughts on that game? Um, yeah, it's a very humbling experience um, on the sideline, and you know, just seeing a team that were better than us in every aspect, really. Um, physically, I thought they were stronger, quicker. Um, really worked hard to get after the ball. I thought we got out full, outworked, and um, yeah, tactically they were spot on, knew their roles, and um, you can see a team that's full time and. I'm on a tactics board an hour before the game, trying to show my players what I want them to do, and I thought that was completely evident today. And yeah, we've got to take it on the chin. Uh, hurts, but um, we've got to learn. Every single one one of us out there has got to learn, myself included. Um, and that's the that's the level that we inspire to get to. They're a team that's up there, and they're one of the favourites this season. I think they are the favourite. One of the only professional outfits in the league. Is that that difference between a team that's got that kind of funding and that full-time resource compared to someone like us? Yeah, like it's it's not an excuse to lose six 0 by any stretch of imagination. Could have been more. Um, so you know that's that's not an excuse. Um, but at the same time, it does help, obviously. Um, yeah, they, I'm sure they would have been in yesterday and and worked on a, a game plan for today. And like I say, we see the boys and hour before so obviously that's that's a massive uh, bonus to be able to do that um, but still that doesn't you know um, mean that you should lose 6 nil just because of that that's not the difference um, you know like I say the, the disappointing thing is I think like you know you're gonna come up against a good team but the hunger and desire that they show, showed compared to us um, which, which is totally unacceptable um, maybe we showed a little bit more of that on on Saturday, but you know that's got to be a given. Got to be a given for any Worthing team um, to play with hunger and desire and to win your battle individually. Um, and yeah, we'll, we'll we'll learn a lot from it. But you know, the disappointing thing I think uh, for me was the amount of goals that they just tapped into the back of the net, un unmarked, unchallenged, and we had players back. Um, so yeah, the the game plan was for players to mark their strikers and follow them all over the pitch and they're in the middle of the goal and, and tapping things in so um, yeah um, plenty plenty for us to learn on. A lot of games coming up for that to happen though obviously Saturday coming up uh, Tuesday as well it's a long it's a big fixture it's actually very congested over the next few weeks is that a good thing just to have so many games that you can sort of work towards and shake that kind of game off? Yeah definitely we, we need to we need to learn and, and be better and you know I, I expect a response expect a response on Saturday you know um, one for players that just want to run and you know Mo Debra I think sets the tone I think um, he picks up moment of the match today just because he's one that can actually press um, similar to what their players can um, and you know sometimes you know that's, that's, that's all you want um, you know you can accept that players are going to be having an off day on the ball um, but there's no excuse for you not being able to run um, and sprint and make it hard for your opponent and we definitely didn't do that today so that's the, the response that we want to see.